How's it going everybody? My name is Hansel, Brave Ready 2. I wanted to show off my Funko Pop collection, which are these little figures I have in the background. Probably might have seen them in almost every video I've done on here since I started collecting them. Um, most of you guys want to know a little bit more about it and everything, so I'm going to show off my collection of uh, which ones I have. I don't really have any rare ones or expensive price ones that most people would have. I put my collection to shame, but that's alright because I only collect the ones that I really want and you know, I haven't really completed a whole set of them because there's like hundreds and thousands of them and there's so many that are still coming out and there's so many that have been retired and some that are only limited and it's just too much money to spend everything. So I'm going to show you guys uh, the ones that I got. So this is my collection right here. I have more over there, but we'll get to those in a bit right now. So for starters, I have Mad Moxie from Borderlands. She's one of my favorite characters in the video game. And it's a really fun game, if I may ask, say so myself. Right here, I have the 10th Doctor from Doctor Who. One of the reasons I got him, because he's one of my favorite doctors, and he's like his little, his little converse. It's freaking adorable. And his little sonic screwdriver right there. In the back right here, I have Black Widow from Age of Ultron with the Captain America shield. She's a bobblehead, and she stands awkwardly, so it's kind of hard to position her to like stay still and everything, so that's why I have her in the back. Right here I have Hatsune Miku, she's a pop star vocaloid, she's basically one of those holograms that's seen in Japan, so if you guys want to do more research on her, you know, feel free to go YouTube it up and, or go on Wikipedia and you'll see what I mean. One of the reasons I like her because her hair right here in the back stands pretty awesome in herself and the detail on this one is really awesome. Next one I have right here is the Pirate Deadpool. Uh, it was a Hot Topic exclusive. Basically, he just has the pirate hat. The one next to him is the rubber chicken one, as you can see right there. Uh, he was a Walgreens exclusive. Uh, the one right here is just a normal one with a thumbs up. And these two was, is the X-Force one right here. And the one next to it is the X-Men one. Found these pretty cheap and decided to get them both. And there's couple more other Deadpools out there, but this is the only ones I got so far. Alright, right here I have uh, Batman for the new Batman vs Superman movie, which I highly recommend going to see, because it was really good, and Ben Affleck was really amazing as Batman. Now, I don't want to really start an argument or anything, but if you don't think so, then it's fine. But I have him, you know, normal right there with his Batarang. The one next to him right there is the Armored Suit Bat- is, uh, not my bad, it was the uh, Nightmare Batman. Uh, which we'll, see, we'll probably see more of in the Justice League movie or the solo Batman movie, I'm hoping. Uh, the top one's right here. This one's Hatsune Miku, the crystallized version. She was a Hot Top exclusive. It's really awesome the way how she looks and how it shines and everything. This one is the Darth Vader Chrome one, which is another Hot Top exclusive, just like Miku over there. This one's just Boba Fett, one of my favorite characters from Star Wars, and this one's Gerard Way from My Chemical Romance, which is another Hot Topic exclusive. <laughs> we got Chewbacca from The Force Awakens, Han Solo, in the back we got Kylo Ren, the hoodless one, there's a different one. Uh, we got Luke Skywalker, R2-D2, and the very first pop I bought, which was the C-3PO that was Chrome. First pop I actually bought from uh, my, from Hot Topic. I don't know why I bought it. I think he was a uh, he was a con exclusive, and Hot Topic had a bunch of these. And I'm like, okay, sure, let me start the pop collection. And well, this is where we are today, because you know I have a crap ton of these little guys everywhere. Uh, right here, just have a first order stormtrooper, Captain. I always forget, Captain Phasma, Captain Plasma, so I forget, but she was in The Force Awakens too. I also got old Han Solo, and I got the old Han Solo with the snow jacket. Let me see if I can move her. Yeah, old Han Solo with the snow jacket, you can tell the difference. Uh, he was a Loot Crate exclusive, but I got it as a gift. So let's go down over here. Uh, just some random stuff I got, but one of the ones that is part of the Funko one is this guy right here. A little Deadpool, I forget what they're called. I think it's Mopes or Mopez or something. I don't know, but it's it's somewhat related to the company, and these are collectibles too. But there's some other junk that I have collected too. Up here is my Harley Quinn collection, as you guys can see, and my favorite two anime characters from Sword Art Online. So this is the normal Harley Quinn with uh, the mallet. This was was the black and white one. 
that one's Hot Topic exclusive. This is the New 52 Harley Quinn. This is the uh, Arkham, Arkham Asylum Harley Quinn. And this is the Arkham Knight. Arkham Knight, I think? Or Arkham, Arkham City, I don't know. And this one's Kirito from Sword Art Online. And this is Asuna from Sword Art Online too. Also right here I got Ant-Man, which I don't know why I have him in the box still. But I also got uh, Stan Lee right there in the box as well. I don't really know why I have him in the box. Probably just because I don't really have enough room anymore over here for anybody else. Yeah. But it's pretty fun. Uh, I don't know how much money I wasted on all this, but... You know, it's it's a hobby of mine. I like I collect the ones that I like. Some people keep it out of the box. Some keep people keep it in. It's basically your choice and everything. There's no right or wrong on collecting and everything. But you know, it's something that I enjoy in my spare time, and I'm always looking to expand my collection and collect the whole set. Just like with the Harley Quinn, I'm probably missing about two of them: the black and white one, and the one where she's holding a gun. Uh, I'm missing those two pretty much. That's about it for her set until the whole Suicide Squad uh, Pops come out. Yeah, and that's basically pretty much about it for my collection right there um, If you guys collect these or you know Or want to look into collecting or anything like that. I highly recommend it and there's some awesome websites I'll link you guys to for to get them most of them are just regular stores like Hot Topic, FYE, Target, Walgreens, Walmart, uh, Barnes and Nobles, and all that stuff. But you guys can find them any anywhere, basically. Well, that's about it for me, guys. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed my pop video for my collection for this. And yeah, uh, I'll see you guys in the next video. This is George Shuli Han, Solo Burger 82, signing off. And may the force be with you. Bye bye.